And now, Fox Carolina First Alert Weather with meteorologist Brian Bachman. And some especially good advice there, given how nice of a weekend we're shaping up to be here. And uh, no doubt many folks looking to get outside to take advantage of the nicer weather. And uh, hey, so far we're so good on this Friday. Looking at satellite and radar, abundant sunshine here across the board. Nice to not see a shower or a thunderstorm anywhere in sight, at least not locally here. Uh, we're going to keep it that way through the first half of the weekend. And even when the chance does come back in for a couple of spotty storms for the second half of the weekend, they're looking isolated at best. So no washouts in the near future expected. Uh, just the opposite. In fact, big dome of high pressure parked over southern Illinois, southeast Missouri and Kentucky, slowly going to build in closer to us here in the Carolinas over the next day and a half or so. And as you can see, it's carved out a nice fair weather bubble of real estate here, and uh, that just means good things for us. It's also helped to usher in the drier air mass that's knocked a lot of the humidity out of the equation and we kept the warmth as an added bonus so it didn't lead to a dramatic drop in temperatures either. As for the next 24 hours, well, spoiler alert, they're looking pretty darn nice here on future track. We go from five o'clock through the uh, seven o'clock time frame this evening. Any limited cloud coverage that's out there scattered fair weather clouds at that uh, will do their usual thing of starting to dwindle off as that sun gets lower in the sky. Looking at clear skies from 11 o'clock straight on through the overnight period here. Those only little flickers of cloud. The only thing to indicate that we're moving forward in time here. Beautiful start on your Saturday morning. Some comfortably cool temperatures with a lot of us waking up to some middle and upper 50s tomorrow morning under these clear conditions, but abundant sunshine through early afternoon. We'll see a wave of some more prominent clouds. It looks like tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening through the five o'clock time frame coming in from a weakening cluster of thunderstorms to the north of us. As you can see, none of those uh, storms are expected to survive beyond the limited cloud coverage that reaches us. Then they break up going into tomorrow evening. It'll be Sunday when that chance for some hit or miss showers and storms returns to the forecast here. Uh, even these again looking to be pretty isolated and you know, pretty sparse by the time they roll in. They'll actually likely be weakening as they try to roll on in. So uh, looking at a, a very nice weekend all told even when that chance for some storms returns coming up on Sunday and for tonight 59 your overnight low temp clear skies cool and comfortable. Nice change of pace here. 86 for tomorrow with continued low humidity, mostly sunny. We'll head toward 88 on Sunday with that isolated chance of a shower or storm, and we'll keep that going into Monday with a high of 85. Tuesday, Wednesday now looking at a nice dry midweek period before the humidity peaks again going into Thursday and Friday and brings back the chance for some summertime storms and the mountains more or less on a similar trajectory. 82 for tomorrow, mostly sunny chances for storms Sunday, Monday with highs in the 70s to low 80s and then similar conditions going into the middle of next week and make sure to download the Fox Carolina First Alert weather app. We'll keep you updated on the weekend forecast and once those storms do start popping up again, you can use the radar in the app to track them in your area.